Okay, so great. Uh, let's look at this question. So the question is asking that at this latitude of 60 degrees north, at 60 degrees north, the scale of a direct Mercator chart is 1 to 3 million. The scale at 60 north is 1 to 3 million. Very good. So what is the scale at the equator? It's very simple, but uh, in its simplicity, it can also be confusing. So you just have to grip uh, the... Uh, the a theory behind it so this is uh, the equator this is how a Mercator chart is formed so it's a reduced model of the earth and around it is the piece of sheet of paper is is placed around it and an illuminated light sort is at the middle this here at the middle so once you have that whatever that is depict uh, Whatever you get here is illuminated on the piece of sheet of paper. Whatever you get like a, a place like this will be illuminated here. So as you can see at the equator, the scale will only be correct at the equator. That's why you have what is on the reduced model will be on that. But at such a place like, let's say, 60 degrees north here, uh, you see a, a small place will be will be will be on, on the sheet of paper will be a, a really long place yeah and you can see even some place like this now you have a, a slight movement so the scale will will change so the property uh, that we use is the scale expands sorry about that the scale expands as a second of it expands as a second as you go away from of the latitude so second means so we have trigonometric properties different trigonometric properties which is sine cos so this ones I, I think we know them so i'll not go into detail into them so we have sine cos and then so we have the inverse of them so the inverse of 1 over sine of an angle we call it we call it cosecant i'm sure you have seen something like this on your calculator and then we also have one over cos which is second so there's a can't I have removed it. No need. So one of a cos we call it second, one of a sine we call it cosecant. So once you have that at the back of your mind, you really need not to know a lot of this math mathematics as long as you know it expands as one of a cos. So here's an example for us. If if let's say the uh, scale at the equator is one two four yeah and one to four corresponds to something like a quarter yeah it is a quarter it doesn't correspond to something like a quarter so if let's say we want the scale at 60 degrees north so it, it will be it will expand as the second one over four times the scale at 60 degrees north which is one over times the second which is one over cos 60 this gives you one over four cos of 60 is 0 0.5 times 0 0.5 which gives you one over two okay so as you can see now the scale becomes one to two at 60 degrees north 60 degrees north so at the equator, the scale is 1 over 4. At the equator, the scale is 1 over 4, which is this. At 60 north, the scale is 1 over 2. So back to the logic that you wanted to state earlier is that as you move away from the equator, the scale expands as the, by this value, by this the scale ex expands by by this which we call second 
So as you can see, one over four, which one is bigger? You can one over four or one to two. Don't don't be fooled. So look at this one is a quarter, and then this one is a half. So obviously a half is bigger than a quarter. Hence the hence the, the that's the reason now we call it expansion of the scale. So back to our question now that we understand what we are doing. Okay. Back to our, our question. So in case you need to anything, you can you can just rub. You can just you can just uh, put, go back and confirm. But now the question is has given us the scale at the at at north, yeah. So the simple uh, uh, thing that you can you can use a simple like formula or something, but if you understand it as well and good, but you can have it as scale. Sorry. So scale at the equator. at the equator times one over cos of latitude this one gives you it gives you the the scale at the latitude so in our question Uh, in our question, at 60 degrees north, the latitude is 60 degrees north, and the scale, <laughs> sorry about that, and the scale, oh, I wasn't recording, okay, sorry about that, at 60 degrees north, the scale on a direct marketer is 1 to 3 million. So, they want the scale at the equator, so, uh, the, oh my god. So they want this scale at the equator. Okay. So we have uh, uh, the scale at the equator is x. That one you don't know. Times 1 over cos 60 should give us the scale of 1 to 3 million. Okay. So, uh, cos, uh, cos 60, so you take this uh, to the other side, it will be x is equals to 1 over 3 million by cos 60. So, x will be because 60 is uh, 0 0.5. 0 0.5 over 3 million. But you you, you note that uh, we always give our ratios in 1 to something. So we need to multiply it by 2 to get 1 and also here by 2. So it will be 1 over 6 million. So this comes to one to six million, and that is your scale at sixty degrees north. So you note that. Ah, oh, sorry, this is the scale at the equator. No, at the equator. So the scale was one to six million, and at uh, sixty degrees north, it was one to three million. So at sixty degrees north, it has expanded. Yeah, by expansion, the ratio is bigger than this one. Oh, thank you very much. Okay.